Hey guys, I'm back with a review for Alien Covenant. Got to watch that this afternoon at the theater, and uh, I enjoyed it. I really did. I um, I don't really didn't go into it with the same expectations that I think many people are going into this thing with, which is they want a lot of answers, they want connectivity to the other films. Um, I mean, <clears throat> I look at this like. Friday the 13th or Halloween series. I mean, uh, if you get a storyline and a plot that is entertaining and fun, how come you can't just keep doing that? I mean, if it works, why why change it? But I think a lot of people are going into this, particularly with Prometheus, on the heels of Prometheus, with they want all these answers, and when they don't get them, they're just not satisfied. Um, you know, Friday the 13th Part 8 was just a continuing the same story arc over and over and over, and I love that movie. Uh, the Halloween films are just a continuation of the same story arc over and over and over. So I don't, I'm not really in the camp of we got to get a lot of answers to previous questions, and we got to get a progression. The film's got to be going somewhere. The story arc's got to be going somewhere new and more exciting and different. Uh, all these reveals that I think people are searching for. How can we just, just take the film at face value? It's a storyline that uh, worked in Alien. It worked in Aliens. Uh, it was kind of a mishit with Alien 3, I think. Alien 3 was a mishit. But basically, it's... It, 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 the movie looks beautiful. The cinematography is beautiful. Nobody can make a science fiction film or a horror film look like a Ridley Scott film, other than Ridley Scott. It's just, it's just a gorgeous movie. And uh, you know, the aliens and the special effects, the, the different variants of the aliens, was just fantastic. I mean, it, I have no complaints about any of that. Um, Returning to the film is Michael Fassbender, who really stole the show. And uh, the, the final girl, Kathleen Waterston, I thought, did a good job as well. She had a lot of elements to her, of, uh, similarly to Sigourney Weaver. and I thought she did an admirable job. Uh, I, thought, I thought the whole cast did a good job. I, I really enjoyed the film, and I would recommend you go see it. I really don't want to give you too many spoilers, but what I will say is there is a connectivity. Well, first off, the film really, to me, starts out like a, a reboot of the original Alien and maybe the Alien storyline combined. Uh, and, then, and then it attempted to tie in some of the Prometheus elements, particularly with the engineers. Uh, and you do get answers to some of the questions like, what was the disposition of the engineers? What happened? Uh, what happened at the end of Prometheus uh, with Shaw and David when they took the ship and decided they would go to see, go to the origins of where the ship originated from? You get those answers. You might not get them in a way that you like, uh, and I don't think that was the real. I don't think that was really the reason for the film to exist. I think it's just a good alien film. Uh, but it's basically the same storyline as the original Alien, just on, you know, and I don't have a problem with that. I mean, it's a, it's a story that works. It's claustrophobic, great special effects, great cinematography, great action, great gore. Uh, so what more do you want? So if it's, I mean, the fact that it's the same or similar to the other Alien films or you know, so is Friday Thirteenth Part Eight, Five, Six, Seven, and Eight. I mean, so are the Halloween films. So I, I guess my, you know, if you enjoy a repetitive story arc that works, what's wrong with that? And I did. I enjoyed it. I don't want to spoil it for you, but I do uh, highly suggest you, uh, if you like Alien, you're going to like this film, as long as you don't get caught up too much in getting answers to everything or getting a, a story arc that ties in with all the Prometheus and 
aliens and somehow comes to us in a nice ribbon and package. I mean, if that's what you're looking for, you're probably going to be frustrated, disappointed with it, uh, because I don't think it. Uh, that's really the intent of the film. I think it. I think it's just basically a, a damn good alien film, another one, and I enjoyed it for what it was. So uh, I don't really want to get too much into the storyline or the plot points because many of you may not have seen it, so I don't want to spoil it for you. But uh, just wanted to give you my initial thoughts, and then uh, maybe I'll come back at a later date with a more detailed review. But I recommend it. I liked it. Thanks for watching.